Here's the uh, USB adapter for the Mama Max Pro. It plugs into the wire coming from the ESC to program the uh, Castle ESC. You can pay for 24 bucks for it at the store with the cable. Or you can get your own camera cable, mini USB to USB, and Castle's website and ask them for that little adapter, free. They'll mail it to you. And uh, just put in a new Savox steering servo, 100 ounce of torque at 0.14 seconds. I just wanted to show uh, real quick the uh, if you're going to upgrade your electronic speed control on your team associated you would probably want to get the mama max pro from castle creations it's for censored and sensorless motors brush or brushless it does everything it's good for like 150 amps and 25 volts so uh, you can get the with the motor you can get the combo for about 130 bucks or so but uh, you know I was going to show you the software real quick I have it hooked up to the car right now the three wire coming out of the ECS just plugs into this. Uh, you can buy it at the store, the USB adapter that hooks up to your computer, and you download the software free. It's 24 bucks for the software, I mean for the uh, USB link, or you could at the store, or you could just uh, go to the Castle website and get it free. Ask them to mail you one. And then you just need a USB cable, a standard camera USB, mini USB, and USB. Anyway, here's the basic. We have auto lipo, 3.2 volts cutoff, reverse. Our brake is 80%. That's where I want it. Power, 100%. Reverse power, 80%. You'll note that your stock ESC from Team Associate only goes like 15%. I got tired of that right away. Advanced. We go with BEC voltage, that's the voltage to your uh, receiver. Arming timing is just most everything's default. Start power is low, and if you have any questions, sensorless motor type, we're running a, a sensorless motor, of course, the 4600 four pole. So we're normal. You, you could change your timing in here and everything on motors. And if you have a question exactly what each area is for, it explains it fully. Let's go into my throttle curve. I made it this. You just hold your mouse on this and change it. Brake curve I made there. It's in relation to the uh, your throttle trigger of the curve instead of straight. You can make it however you want. Our software, I just updated the software and the firmware on the ESC. And then we would just do an update of all our settings. And it's programmed. And you know for sure what they are instead of using the little beep trigger method on the ESC by sound. It's not very reliable to me, so that's the end for now.